Stop and smell the roses. Incredibly fragrant right here at the E.M. Mills Garden. So beautiful this time of year. The buds are blooming early in Thornton Park, and it's such a sight. You just got to see it. Oh, well, let's see it right now. News Channel 9's Lindsay Rachel joins us there. Lindsay, I understand they're gearing up for a special show. Tell us about that. Yeah, they are getting ready for their rose show this weekend. You know, just like the spring flowers and the strawberries, that early 90 degree heat really sped up the roses, too. Take a look. Here at the E.M. Mills Rose Garden at Thorndon Park, there are 3,500 rose bushes, and they're all taken care of by the Syracuse Rose Society. After a hiatus in 2020, they weren't able to host their Rose Day, but they did today, and they're looking forward to hosting their Rose Show this weekend. They say it's a fun and a friendly competition to show off their rose's beauty. It's a friendly competition, but it is a competition. And uh, some of our members have 200 rows in their personal gardens, 200, 300 roses. I only have 50. So I'm considered small change compared to some of these other members. Uh, but we compete and we have judges come in from out of town and they judge the rose show. And again, educating the public and teaching them that you can win ribbons. Now, the public is welcome to view the show. It's this weekend on Saturday at Destiny USA from 11 until 4.30 in the afternoon. As for the rose garden here, you might want to make it sooner rather than later because the roses are just past peak. Live in Syracuse, Lindsay Rachel, News Channel 9.